Hello everyone, Test Tube here, and we are back for another Stanley Cup Playoffs. This is Game 4, and right now, we're about to see the next team who will try to take advantage for the win. Right now, it's the Boston Bruins take on against the Pittsburgh Penguins for the first game of the night. Right now, standing by, we have is Meepo. And he'll be standing along with the side reporter of Paintbrush. And in the center ice will be Fan. I'll be here for the post-game show for the three star players of the game. And I'll be see keeping an eyes on you guys back for the second part of the game. Right now, we're back at Pittsburgh. Guys, it's all yours. Enjoy your next game. This is Game 4 of the Stanley Cup Playoffs. I'm Meat Phone along with Paintbrush, and we are happy to be back here at the BBG Paints Arena. The starting goaltenders are ready to get on the line, and we are ready for the fourth game of the night. Puck is strapped, and we are underway. The courtesy lineup is being here as follows. We have his Kuchets now, Raquel, and it's Latang, Dumoulin, and we have a cross out, it's, it's, it's Sidney Crosby. The starting goaltender will be Lena Solmar. On the other hand, right now, we have his McAvoy. And it's Marchand in the win. Then over, on the other side, we have his Bergeron. Right toward the back of the other way now is the Smith. The Smith is a starting goaltender for Game 4 of the Stanley Cup Playoffs. He's never been able to be playing with this game here before, but now this is his moment to try to bring this game here for the Smith to see what he has. Because he never played it here in, a, in the playoffs before, because this moment keeps on living. Latang, Dumoulin with the buck. Try to reach across over the ball kid. Chuck with the stop. That's kicked away here by Omar. Latang swings to Dumoulin. Malkin trying to reach one here in the puck. Now it's McAvoy taking it over the way. Now swings it over across over to Marchand. Then DeBrus. In the attacking zone. Shot! Stopped by the Smith. Dumoulin will face things up here on the offensive side. Now it's Sucker. And taking a block shot from Marchand. Stopped here by the Smith. The Smith swings over to Russ. Russ takes a big hit. Zucker regrounds, regroups the puck and try to switch over on the offensive side. Try to swing it toward back over to Gremlin. Kicks the puck over to Petri. Now swings to Pedersen. With the shot! We'll stop here with the play for Allmark as the faceoff's coming up next. With 16-3 to go. Now with the puck, here's Carlo. Carter with the puck. Taking over is Kreji. Kreji swings to Zacha. Zacha trying to go with the pucker with the movement. Poked it away. Finally along the puck here for the loose puck. Now swings over to Pedersen. He swings across over to Hennen. Heenan in the puck here now slinging the puck over again to Grenlin. Grenlin with the shot. Stopped here with the pad save, with the kick blade save. Patterson back over to Petri. Petri with the shot of the angle. Elmer with a stop save. Making good contacts out here with a good connection. They're really on the focus front of the games of the setup. When the player gets over with the open angle, he gets a right away with the good feet and take it over from deliberation. Now he is led home back to the other side. Lindholm trying to look for an open pass man advantage. Swings over to Pasternox. In the corner. Benino. Over to Archibald. Firing the puck over, over to O'Connor. Try to swing it across again to Kulakov. Kulakov back to O'Connor. Stick lifted, but it's hold on for Gutzetzel. Kreji right toward the back of the offense again to Lindholm. Back over to Zacho. The Bruins are in the offense zone to take their own run. The Smith will cover the puck here. Back with the Smith one. Because you know, the Smith was able to try to make that one a good setup. The transition is very uh, tricky. But don't get in mind, they're not going to play it up there. Russ scores! That's his first goal in the playoffs in game four. Brian really keeping it over. After Ramalkin, then Russ. 
Turned that one in. It hit off the stick and it was deflected right toward the player on the offender. That was taking out of control. That turned it over to be a huge change. Really well done here from Alkid after Freeman. And he had that one with a good pass here over to Russ. Russ with his first goal of the playoffs in game four. Trying to race towards with the attacking to try to race toward it in game five here back at Boston. Right there and there. Now the players are set, ready to take the inbound in the offense zone. The score for the Pittsburgh is 1-0. Now here's Orloff. Orloff to Frederick. That's a fuck it up again. Now swings to Malkin, firing the puck across here, down over up to the other hand to Russ. Russ swings his upper back over to Friedman. He swings to Kolokov back the other way to Friedman. Friedman swings over to Russ. Now swings back to Kolokov. Penguins moving around the buck here, round and round they go. Now always got to make sure that you get that one a good hand. Russ in the middle. Backhander kicked away by Omar. Friedman outside. Trying to take a shot. That's stopped here again by Omar. McAvoy's got it across here in the offense zone, trying to pick up the speed. Olaf with the puck in middle, facing over to Coyle. The Bruins are in the offense zone to pick up their own territory. Got saved by the Smith. Russ with the puck. Try to put it back on the attacker. Move over to Carter. Carter towards the wing. With the move around chain, gets bumped up behind by McAvoy. McAvoy with a little bump on the check. Wants to get a little physical contact here in order to try to make sure he was okay there. But hey, don't try to get over the puck if you're going to try to stop one. McAvoy, right to Bertuzzi. With no set, it's stopped made by DeSmith. Patterson, that puck gets carried out of the zone and now goes back to the offense zone for the Bruins. Now the Crosby. Crosby! Shot! That deflected off the toward the goaltender to try to make the shot, but it was off target. Sidney Crosby's got the puck here, now in the offense zone. Can't find a man opener. Patria Marchand. That goes stacking up here on DeSmith. Moves to half away. Sidney Crosby on him. DeSmith trying to hold the puck here in, in the board and bound. Madison tries again. Now he swings to Kucic now. Tries to get away. Here's another attacker for Raquel. Raquel back to Pedersen right over again to Kucic now. To snipe the puck. That's blocked away and turned it over. Kucic now swings over to Pedersen. Pedersen swings off to Kucic now. Taking a little defender off of the hit. Latang. Trying to move toward the middle. Kucic now back over to Pedersen. With the shot. Slammed, but it's been knocked over into the front of the, front of the player. Kucic now blocking the way with the sharp shave. Ornino to Pedersen. Back to Latay. Fires across the net. That's stopped again here by Carlo. Boston regaining the group here on offense. Now in the territory for the Penguins. They brought shot. That goes off the player, and it goes off the stick. Bornino over to Archibald. 7-10 left to go in the first period. Still 1-0 lead, Penguins. O'Connor swings to Bonino. Back to Latang. Latang shot. Stuck made here by Omar. Omar really had that one with the good side. Really keeping his own as defender, because that was a very tough one to try to keep it up with the puck. He lost last time here in game three. That was not going to be an option here because of that point. They really have a hard one to try to put it inbound. Not going to be enough, but though, if you're going to keep on going, keep on playing. Slam across the board. Dumoulin right around the back. They will try to regroup the offense zone. Now they will try to fix it, and now they will get it on the play. Pass broke it up. Critchy at the buck here in the offense territory for the Penguins. Bassett broken up and Bostinox is leaving the zone early. Azacha has it over back to Critchy. Hooks it away, Latang with the puck. And it's a little stop here, going again by Hennon. Carter with the puck. Race towards the side of the net. 
Pass to Kramer. Kramer to Heenan. Heenan trying to loosen it up with the putt. Kroji with the puck now racing towards the other side, passing the neutral zone to the Penguin zone. 4.30 left to play in the first period. Freeman takes it over. Russ brings it back over again to Malkin. Malkin racing, breaking the cover. Shoots it for the net. That's stopped here by Omar. Battling for the loose puck. Russ has it now. Recovers. Swings to Kolokov over to Freeman. That turns over to Lindholm. You see, because they were lifting the stick up again, they were trying to make a big save out of him. They were trying to lose the puck and then go back to the offensive play in this inbound. This gives a killing time for the moment that they nearly need to keep it going. Ours are not really that much. they got to find somebody else to do it. The Penguins regain their group on offense and kick up their own territory. Malkin, shot made, stopped by Walmart. Patterson regroups the puck, now finds Freeman. Freeman swinging up for the Patterson. Patterson back over to Freeman. Takes a shot. That deflect is off the goaltender. And now right toward the glass. Demolgin. In a middle transition. Now able to pick up a good run. In traffic jam. Putting a bang out of it. Puget still. May have to hold on with that one as, they, as the players are offside of the call. Not really an offside, but they're out, but they're out of a zone. They're leaving it too early to leave it out here. They don't want that one to be stepped out. Frederick recovers the puck here with passing 90 seconds to play in the first period. To Smith will take a quick save here and right now toward back the airway is Raquel. Trying to face forward again here to Malkin. Malkin banging it up. Ruchet Sal. With a shot, trying to take it over from, from Omar, but it's leaped up untouched. Patterson swings over to Petri. Petri right toward the middle. Back in there. Stop it here. But it blocked defender. Frederick moving it across. Firing the puck in deep. Now he swings back to Archibald. Now O'Connor. That one's given over to Forborn. 12 seconds to play in the first period. Malkin. Race toward the inside of the middle. Takes it with the shot. Shoots, and not much out there, no score made, and that will end the first period. one nothing. as with a good shot for Rust. That puts him a good help here from the player of Malkin. Be right back for the second quarter. And if you're just tuning in to the second period of the Stanley Cup playoffs, we got the second one coming up. And we're ready to take in for the second period of fourth game. Right now the Penguins have a 1-0 lead for the start here after the first period of the Rust score. It's very clearly because the Rust was able to do well here on offense. They're a very good team right now to keep that one in here. As they played for last season against the New York Rangers, they were able to make that one a good stop. How they happen? Well, they may have to know with that one with a good shot they take. Every other angle, they are really well to try to maintain their pressure. Here's Sidney Crosby trying to take the shot. Oh, he quits that cell in the back of an angle. Out of play and focus. Now to Marchand, back the air away. The Bruins carry to the offense zone for the Penguins' territory. Move around to Bergeron. Shot stopped by DeSmith. DeBrus with the puck. Shotty, oh, hit the goalposts. That was a close call and it almost went to flick it in. Yeah, you can see what his deflection was able to make that one, they say. The puck was out. He wasn't able to make that one puck right in the move. And it looks like the, the breast missed it. He went too wide. And that was trying to be an off on the play. And it didn't help him go get covered. Icing whistled on Pittsburgh with 17.31 to go in the second period. Now with the better play, we have this fan. David Pasternak is really keeping this right on the good side of the track. He calls this one of the team calling for snipe. When he gets his puck here, he makes that one of the good to hit the hit the slap shot of a goal and snipe it back the air away. With the better of the team, he has given up to one of the players that has a lot of a, a strengths. I'll be keeping an eye here on David Pasternak for an error snipe goal to pick up the run and take the play in mount. Guys, back to you. Pasternak's right toward the wing. Now taking over again. 
fires the puck across the the board. Trying to take an inbound impact right around the Bauer. Raquel. Pedersen. Swings to Petri. Now back over to Pedersen. In behind the net is Carter. Back to Raquel. Raquel, take the backhand. Stop with the toe save here by Omar. Lundbom plays over to Kretschy. Kretschy towards the right angle. Into Pasternak. Shot. Went too wide off the board. Try to take over the inbounding. Smash down. That takes it over again. You see, because the Brewers are wanting to take the bear and then they want the Penguins to try to shut them down. Man, that really is going to be a hard one to make that one a hit call. Freeman on the outside. Takes a shot. Deflected off the glass. Now Pasha knocks back the airway to in the Penguins territory. Try to look over to Bertuzzi. Bertuzzi! Stop with the shot block save and it goes back to Carter. Penguins in the offense zone in the paint Bruins territory. Kolokov back to Freeman. Freeman right back over to Archibald. Back here with the shot. Stop with the quick save here by Omar. And it turns over to be Bertuzzi's with the puck. Trying to keep the play moving. Now goes over to Pasternak. On the right corner of the wing. Gives it back to Archibald. Swings to Bonino. And will face the puck to head go around the wall, around the net, and now face back the airway. Clifton going right over to Frederick. Trying to poke it away. Russ takes it over. Takes a smack. Clifton on him. And goes right after him. Takes the block pass. Puck leaves out of the zone, and now we'll have to force to regroup again. Yeah, you're going to need to fix this one up. You don't want this one to come happening like it's going to happen every time that you're going to need to try to fix it. Demolin, back to Malkin. Now here's Latay. Fires across, and Omar stops save. We'll hold it with under 12 minutes to go in the second period. It is a tough one to try to keep it loose. Now with the play, if Omar, here's what Van has to say. Omar has an x-ray vision to keep that one right in the pursuit. The more better saves, the better that he has. He has a lot of him to take over and is responsive to maintain his way. Sidney Crosby has a lot of him to try to take over here and Glutex now with the snipe might be a hard one to try to regain the group. I'll be keeping an eye on here for, for Linus Omar and this will be another great factor with the save to try to put it inbound. Guys, back to you. Sidney Crosby back over to Petri. Swings over to Pedersen, back to Sidney Crosby. Taking a pass for the bumper. Oh man, that is a smackdown. Crosby's really trying to put it up here. They're really trying to struggle it up again. Marchand with the puck. Now with only passing down to a mid-period range. Marchand. Then his puck was carried loose. Swings to Crosby. Crosby losing the control. And Crosby has it back. Swings to Gutsetsa. Back to Crosby. Crosby! Not able to look at it in time. Crosby swings back to Petri. Back to Pedersen. Now back to Archibald. Archibald lost the puck. Crosby with the puck. Trying to move it forward. See you later to save here by Lena Salmar. That was very tough. I had to say, because of this moment, because you know that Sidney Crosby was able to make that one a shot timing goal, he was going to go right around it. But that didn't stop here. That was going to be a tough call, and you know it before. Freeman with the puck, now back over to Kolokov. Call out to Archibald. That goes out of play. McAvoy's guy now with 8.30 to go in the second period. Hits the bar and it goes out of play. Both tier players are set ready to take the face off. Pittsburgh Penguins still have a 1-0 lead over the Bruins. And now they're trying to keep it over again. Now here's Greer back over to Nozick. Nozick around him. With a move, O.D. Smith save and puts it back the airway. Oh, trying to rumble down, and Kolokov made a stop. 
easier in that play because you know that the Smith was able to pick up his run. Try to go for the biggest. Malkin. Try to smack it around. The Bruins regain the group on offense. And taken away. Greer with the puck. Stopped by the Smith. Ball with the shot. Greer tries again. And focus tight. That shot goes off target. Friedman back toward the airway. Now go over to Zucker. And not enough to pick up the momentum with the pass. Half away, regrouping the puck here in an offense zone. Freeman trying to put a, put a poke check. Demole, good block here. Now pass to Carlo. Carlo to Crunchy. Crunchy! He could stop here by the Smith. Zucker swings it across. Malkin regroups the puck now without being called icing as it leads off to a silent whistle. Demole. Shot! Looks saved by Omar. 537 left to go in the second period. It's still coming to a tight game. And you know that Linus Omar and their team, the Smith and those guys, have a higher in rate. The inbound is very tough and you can definitely feel when the player was able to go with the Smith without Jari because he had done three games in a row. I mean, he was very that good. Try to keep an eye on this one here because he was very that low and try to make that one a good stop. Right now the Smith will try to hold the puck here with only 5.09 to go in the second period. Leaving the clock wind down, it is a 1-0 lead, still Penguins. Now here's the faceoff win. Orla, shot stopped by the Smith. 5.02 stopped the clock here in second period. He's really well, trying to show him up. Now here another face-off win to McAvoy. All off shot, stopped by the Smith, back to Latang. They're really on a focus one, they need to go with that one. And then, move the puck, scores! And with the goal, now goes with a 2 nothing lead in the fourth game. Hannah was going to make that one in there. And you know that Chris Tang was going to send it over to Hannah? Guess what he does? Pass and score. That was a perfect play. Easy for enough for here for Hannah as for Latang makes that when he sent and pass. This one was a very tough one to keep an eyes on Skittle. Because of the puck zone was ability to take over to Latang, he was able to make that one a quick move. He got a good eye contact. Very good pass, very good accuracy, with the motion acceptable. I'll be keeping a nice year on the tank, and we'll see if it end gets a second goal of the game. Guys, back to you. Move around the puck. Stop with the cover. And the Smith got it away. He really got to show that one with respect. You've got to show what you've got. With the pass, O'Connor. Oh, great stop here by Omar. This one goes back the airway to McAvoy. Edmund with the puck. Now swing in the middle over to Frederick. Shot! This flick it off here with the Tepatose. O'Connor, Patterson back to Petri. Now swings across here to Archibald. We'll leave though an icing call here with Pittsburgh with only 3.06 to go in a second. Both players are set in a gliding offense zone. Now with the win, Patterson will take the group of the puck. We'll kick it off to Carter. Carter wins in the faceoff here. He finally is sticking it out to his moment success to make his home move team to his life to hit the board on the deck. Better plays than ever, you know? You just don't have to give up anyway. Coyle, move around the puck. Deflect it off again. This kicks the puck over. Oh, booming offside of the call on Boston. Now it's only 2.09 to go. Now they will be back in the neutral zone, face-off zone. Now they're ready to do this one again. Penguins extend 2-0. They could be tying the series up by 2. Now this one goes off to out of play. 
Raquel swings the puck over again. Crosby wins it over. Trying to go with the backhand. Oh, Olmark save. And one just uh, can't believe. And he's just going to make that backhand beauty. Well, it's not very particular. You, you couldn't just try to keep a focus out of the game. But you've got to make sure you got to keep your eyes on the pride there. Might need to fix some changes here for Crosby. Bergeron wins the faceoff. Now Marchand wins it. Now sends it over into the Penguins' territory. Try to pick up and play. Now here's Crosby. Crosby! Gonna do it! Stop A by Omar. Very close call as Omar was able to see that motion and drive as the reaction comes in quick on Sidney Crosby. Yeah, he was definitely doing it right. I mean, just go with the flow. You gotta need to stay focused on this game. Bergeron wins it. Nearing the final minute in the second period, it's a 2-0 lead for Pittsburgh Penguins. And right now with the pass, DeBrus hit the head of the, of the hand and it goes out of here. Lindholm recovering the puck over to Bergeron. Bergeron trying to work his way onto the Russell. To Marchand, that's blocked up by Latang. And Zucker has the puck. Zucker goes big down in. Trying to give it over again. To Malkin with the shot and stopped by Omar. Two periods complete. We're down to the final period left. And as you call this one, send it over to the tank, over to Hennig. That's a great play. Third period about to begin right on game four. And it's been a tremendous night here as we saw some great saves by the Smith and a great shot and send it for the tank over to Hennig. They're a very good, tough team to try to keep it going. What do you think? I agree that the Smith was definitely one of the bestest right now. The secondary goaltender, I mean, you've got to be kidding me. He's really one of the bestest. Try to put that one in bounding. And you know that the Smith was able to make that game. He never played it here before. He was watching it closely. Crosby! Hoots that cell sends back again as Raquel tries to hold on. You know the pressure didn't really help him. Crosby needs to help him with a good look at the offense. He can't leave him out there with an open, empty, empty netter. And DeBrus. Here's the fast break. And DeBrus poked away. And oh, the Smith. What a play making here. 18 13 in the third period. Coming up for the faceoff. Now they're ready to do this one again. The Penguins extend their run 2 0. Over the Bruins. Orlov towards the Kreji. Shot. Rebound. Hit the goalpost the second time for the Bruins. All they did, they never really caught on with that one. That was a close call. And a stop made by the Smith. Try to put it back in the air away to Pasternak. Blocked away. Addison recouping the puck here on offense for the Pittsburgh. Here. Oh, you better show with that face motion. You know, that's a smacker. What a stop. McAvoy back the other way. Blocked away. And pass it back, step again. Trying to regroup it. Another textbook save here by DeSmith. Malkin will try to clear the puck out. Zucker will leave it hanging. We'll give it back to Russ. New line change as Petri will try to hold the puck down. Orlov recovering the puck here on the Bruins territory. Boston regaining the group. Fling the puck. Scoop up along the board by Pedersen. Swings to Granlin. Pittsburgh in the offensive zone. Toward the middle. Shot and stopped by Lindholm. Now swings back to Bertuzzi. Right to the middle, slopped it down as the Smith takes it and denies the shot. Really keeping that call because that was given of a good feed here. Might need to keep that one going. No penalties in between the two. They're very a good tough team. 
And icing is whistled on Pittsburgh with 14.45 left to go in the third. Penguins and the Bruins are in the face-off battle. They're still keeping their eyes on strength, looking for another face-off win. Now for Carter. And the flicker. Coyle. Reverse the Bertuzzi. Oh, to Smith with a stop save. He shows up very good. I mean, that was a very tough call because you can't let that happen. If the other players go with the offense, you just got to stick on to your team. Now to Freeman. Freeman swings over to Archibald. Bertuzzi trying to avoid the tackle. Frederick weaving into the offense zone now. With a look, Carlo, shot, stop, plays the Smith. That goes back the other way to Freeman. The Penguins regroup their offense zone in the, in the Bruins territory. Off to Freeman. Gives it to O'Connor. Moves quickly over to Archibald. Back the pass. Bernino shot to nine. Trying to regain the group on offense. Freeman back over to O'Connor. O'Connor right over to Archibald. Look the middle. No penalty called on Boston. And it was going to be a hooking call. Mm -hmm. Yep, yep, yep. You know that one, because that should have been a hook. They could have called it for slashing. Bergeron stopped here by the Smith. Archibald sends the airway down with only 12 minutes gone by in the third period. Sidney Crosby back the airway now. Gives it to Demolet. And goes with a bad change off. Friedman will try to give it off to Crosby. Now Bergeron steps in. Making a move in front, and a glove save by the Smith. Archibald recovers it over again to Crosby. Clifton. Scooping it up as Marksman. Toward the middle. DeMullen denies it. And that and it goes back over to DeSmith. Over again to Archibald. Archibald trying to send in a deliberation. With a one or two. Archibald did not see what the puck was going to Crosby. As it was carried off the pass. Clifton. With the shot. Denied him. Ruchet Snell with the puck now in the offense zone to take it for another run. Tries to give it to Latang. Pass broken up. Crangy with the puck now swings to Pasternak. Crosby smacks down on Chris Attack. Trying to give a puck pass over and Raquel tries to save the day. Now in offense territory, Raquel swings over again to Gugucetso. Off to Crosby, shoots and deflected off the player again. Try to give a pass to Latang back to Raquel. Over to Gugucetso. Takes the shot, it's blocked up in front. They're very authentic now, they must hold on. Crosby, Gugucetso, blocked again. Raquel swinging back to the offense zone, trying to pick up his own attempt. Clifton takes it over. Players are still looking for the open defenseman to try to break the chain in with a shutout score. That stop made here with the goaltender. Now here's Malkin. Malkin trying to swing it over. No penalty call here for Pope Boston. Four to Zacha. Now back to Zosa. In the attacking zone is Zacha. In a moving front. Now he gives it back over to Russ. Russ gives it back again. We'll have to give it over to Forbarant with the goal. Go ahead, chance for McAvoy. Seven minutes gone by in the third period. Half away. Back into Nozak. Shot blocked by Petri. You call this one here. That's a good block here to try to regain the group. That offense is never going to slow down. Harrison the sucker over again to Petri. Petri pulls out. Leaves the puck low zone without being called offside. And now they're back to do it again. No set with the other way. Trying to make a move in front. Oh, the Smith save. Hold the puck with 6 or 3 to go in the third period. It's still a 2 0 game. Teams are set, ready to take the face off in the offense zone. Penguins are doing the best they can in the fourth game. It's a 2-0 lead. 
Here's Orlov. McAvoy. And takes the poke check. Brennan with a move. Oh, stopped by Omar. Brennan recovers the puck back over to Petri. Petri carries out with the puck. Now Pedersen will try to keep the puck in deck. Now back to Granlin. Won't be able to take the authentic run. And Hannon comes in to try to take it away. You see, because of this one, really can't be happening like that. They don't have enough advantage to make the skills. They've got to fix somebody up. It's not going to be easy if you're going to try to like keep the puck and moving. And if you get knocked out of the by a defender, I mean, don't try to take over it. Omar will try to hold the save here with only 4.37 left to go in the third period. Now they're back into the offense zone to try to pick up the run for in the Penguins to Bruins territory. Now with Zucker. Bertuzzi. Swings back over to the offense zone in the side. Frederick outside. Back to Orloff. Orla moving it over. Bertuzzi! Oh, the Smith save! Now 4-4-6 four four remaining in the third period. Keeping an ice in deck here to keep the play running. Exactly they do. Great day for the Penguins to try to keep up their scores and maintain their way under pressure. Dumoulin over to Archibald. Orla right to front of it. Stop again by the Smith. Oh my goodness, he is on fire tonight. Without Jari, I think he's going to do, he's going to make that one pay for the price he needs. Yeah, he's really do. I mean, don't judge on the, on the Smith. He's really well to take over for the run. Omar will try to hold it from here with only 3.23 left to play in the third period. Now the players are ready to take inbounding in the offense side. Now with the win, here's DeBrus. Now finds over McAvoy. Swings to Bergeron. 3.05 left to go in the third period. Zucker swings off across again to Mulgan. Laying a time, go down. Freeman right outside. Trying to take a fast move. And Zucker couldn't make a save here to hit the goal. DeBrus' turn. Almost poke checked it away, but Bergeron. Stop! And Marchand scores! They're now down by one. No shutout scores. They're going to keep it the way they have it. Brad Marchand was able to try to go from the deck. With the rebounding, he was covering in. Break away the chain scores. We have no rights to do this. We have to stay in back and bound to try to regroup the offense. With Brad Merchant, he has that one saved and taken from the puck line. I'll be keeping an eyes on him for the next one for Brad Merchant to keep the scoring coming. Guys, blocked the shot by Olaf. Down under two minutes to go in the third period, back over to DeBrus. DeBrus finding himself in open room to Merchant. Trying to go for the tiebreaker chain. Bergeron, T scores! We're tied up now. The third period is not going to be easy enough because Pat Bergeron was really keeping a good show on. The teams are tied up by two. Looking for a way to make the lead in counter. We're under 90 seconds to play in the third period. Now it's Malkin. Petri will try to regroup here in offense. Now Zucker swings to Rust. Rust finding again over to Petri. Karachi trying to make a move. One minute left to play in the third period as the time comes down. Malkin will try to reach over it. Lindholm reach across to Zacha. Zacha moves it across in the offense zone. Trying to give it off to Malkin. Karachi off to Zacha. D Smith. Oh, just wearing up with the bad save here, and it still keeps on going. Not a better call because you want to give that one a stop. He's going to take it. Oh, man, that was a mash out. Malkin, shot, deflected off again with the pad. Kreji finding over again to Lindholm. Lindholm trying to face over again to Kreji. Kreji to Postonox. 15 seconds left to go. Zatra trying to move it. Oh, the Smith save. 
Asherox keeps it closed with a win! Back behind the goal net. Will not try to make a win, and that will end the third period. Regulation period's over, but overtime is coming on their way when we come back. Bertrand ties it. We'll get the fourth and final for the for the overtime coming up after this. It has been a tremendous night to start off with a 2 0 lead for the Pittsburgh Penguins in the first two periods, but now Boston's Bruins are trying to make their way with the contact shot. They are very off to a heap of run to try to tie this game up. Easy on that one place. They can never be stopped alone. If they want to try to save it all, then you've got to save with yourself. Right now, overtime period will be the next one to determine. This is going to be a crazy one since the last game has determined. With the Penguins win, they definitely did turn out a great job with the fantastic stop. It's all it did turn out once more than they have. Now here we go. Overtime period starts now. Overtime setting about to begin. And they're going to see who's going to get the next goal to take it or tie it. Crosby and the team ready for the extra period. Here's Marchand. Over around Crosby. Crosby blocked the shot. Now Gujasel will try to keep the range out of it. The tight end bound to Crosby. Oh man, that pass was been broken up here, but a good stop made by Omar. Now Gujasel right towards the offensive side. Now finds Crosby. Lindholm trying to reach across here to the offside of the player. To Marchand. Marchand trying to move it in front. Stick it away. Gucet now with a move. Shot stopped by Omar. He's really on a struggle run. You mean you got to watch him when he was going to do. When he gets that play, don't try to lose him. That focus is on the attention. Bergeron, two-time stop here by the Smith. Latang with it now. To Kucet stop. New line changing, coming in. Here's Malkin! Oh, back to the save here by Omar. 2.35 to go in the first for the overtime period. Kucek's now trying to regain the group. Lost the puck. McAvoy will try to regroup their offense to march in. Here's a chance. Bergeron locked away. Battling for the loose puck. Here's Kucek's now. Bangs out of the trouble. Bergeron stopped by DeSmith. Now back their way is Malkin. Malkin trying to make a move. Put the one! And Omar stopped making a save here with one minute and 51 seconds. Very hard to keep it set up again. I mean, that's for sure. You're going to need to keep this one going. Now the players are in set, ready to take the inbound. And with a chance, McAvoy. Try to take it across into the neutral. To Pasternak, shot! Deflect it off again on to Smith. Another run. Passes up again over to Malkin. Malkin shoots! Stop here by Omar. Open look. Latang shoots one. Reflect it in and it's knocked out. Be keeping an eye on that when they shut down here on offense. They were really trying to put an aggressive run. They don't have a much advantage time. They have no time to spare. They've got to do something else. Latang takes it over. Carter with the outside. Now over again to Latang. Carter waits around. Tries to give it off to Latang with a minute left to play in overtime. They've got to get some shots in there. They gotta move around. They gotta get over it before they before it comes down to expiration. Lindholm trying to put it around the deck. Moves to Pasternak. Pasternak's right toward the way. Take the pack puck. Carter with the puck now in releasing control. With a move. Roll the shot. Omar save. Raquel. And call the cup. Oh, never stop made by Omar. And Raquel. Nowhere to be found. That's off the target. 20 seconds left. They have to do it now. Here's Carter. Swings back the airway. 
The pass back over to Raquel. For the shot, Taylor! And it's all rock stop again. Kolokov needs to get this one focused. Shot! Oh, stop me by Olmark and will hold the play with 4.6 seconds. I mean, there's not going to be a shootout because of this game was not being taken out. Because they know it, but you don't have the right choice. Now with the Wu. Lindholm! And they will not do it in time. We are going to shoot out. Well, because of that overtime, they're not going to get this one successful. I guess that it's going to be a hard one to call in game four. We'll be right back with you after this. In regulation period, we've seen the shootouts part of the game right toward the end of the game. But it looks like the Stanley Cup playoffs is not going to happen. Because of this one, it is going to be a very tough one to make the call if we there is making changes to this game. Because now, there is another way to try to make a save and try to lead the game and take it over with the plunge. An easy plunge needs to go with the recall to try to go back with the shootout. And this is very tough because the Bruins have really faced it across from the wild since the first game was a wild end for the Bruins win. This was happening here before because most of the players are very tough to go and buy. Yeah, you could tell this one here because there was one way that they're going to need to try to fix this up. Because now, they're going to need to try to fix it on the offense and they're going to need to try to switch it up. So they will have to do one man instead of doing the another play advantage in the regular periods. Just like the regular periods in the game of one through three period. The third is very tough. Yep, the offense is very tough to try to keep his eyes on his stride, but not going to be enough to try to kick it over to go with inbound. Now it's time for shootout. We've never done this here before in the second part of the season, in the postseason. So, let's find out what it's about. And right now, we're about to get started. Here we go. The first step in advantage of the play we have is Pastor Knox. Takes around the puck and moves in front, and they have the first one goal. When you see the easy play for Pasternak, he waits around, and this one was around the Smith. It was very hard to kick him bound. Now for the Penguins, assistant captain. Here comes Malkin with the move. Chuck, they flick it off of Oma. Now back the airway again is McAvoy. Bergeron ready to do it. With his time, shooting around will not be in touch here as the Smith will take the stop. Now back the airway is Crosby. Ready to look for the backhander shot. Here he goes. Move around, shot, and nowhere luck. That was stopped here again as Sidney Crosby couldn't find it. Now here comes Merchant. Going for two to win it. It's off again. Last ball, who just now needs to get the tie game up. With the one, shot, and nowhere to be go. That's it. The Bruins wins the third and fourth game. Omar, a star, smackdown on Pittsburgh. They're all saluting it because if Omar was really saving it, this all pressure was putting the liberation. And that will end the game. Now the Bruins have extension to 3-1 over the Penguins. With that score, it will be a win or go home for the Penguins in the fifth game. We'll catch you all next time. As right now, me phone and paint press along with fan business for the presentation of the Stanley Cup playoffs. Now for now for test two, they're the three star players of the game. See you all next time. Good night, everyone. All right there, Mifon, thank you very much. The first star goes out to Pat Patrice Bergeron. A goal and assist. Take the tape feed over again. As for Brad Merchand, he was able to give that one a good shot. The second star goes out to Linus Allmark. 42 saves and just putting up a good one here for tonight. Really saving out the best. And for number one goes to Casey the Smith. Well, as for well himself, 
He was all good and one and says, no worry, I got this one. First and second period was like a good stopping bandage. But the, for the third period, it turns around. So for that one, it's going to be a close one to make the range. So for that one, your final score is 3-2. to two. Boston, advancing on with a 3-1 to one in a series. Then they're going to need to find out if they can try to take a win in Game 5. The next game that will be coming up here for tonight, it will be the Jets and the Wilds. That will be happening here back at Canada's Life Century, back in Winnipeg. And for standing by, we will have is Jay Sabalski and Greg Ferraro for the next part of the game and the setup. We'll see you all again next time for another Stanley Cup Playoffs. Peace out everyone for a while as the NHL 23 of the Stanley Cup Playoffs on the EA Sports style. See ya folks next time. If you don't, if you don't, somebody will.